Hi, I'm Daniel Overton from CR Kennedy, the Leica Geosystems distributor here in Australia. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to set up your mobile device or field controller and how to use Field360 when you're scanning out on site. Now, Field360 is a free app that you can download from your app store, but you need login credentials to get it up and running. To get login credentials, we need to create a Cyclone Cloud account. So, in our internet browser, we go to Cyclone Cloud click on the register button. We complete some basic personal details and we'll get prompted to verify our email address. Next, we're asked to create our login credentials, username and password. And then finally, prompted to put in our EID, the original license ID that we use to activate in CLM. Now, once you've created this account, you can log into Cyclone Cloud on your computer at any time to see the status of your license. Now another frequently asked question is what is this borrowed license section all about? This is just details of how many devices are currently logged in under these credentials. In my case I only have one active license deployed in the field and it will stay connected until the 8th of January without any internet connection. You can have five devices logged into this app at any one time. Now that we have an active Cyclone Cloud account, we're able to log in to our Field360 app. So we launch the app and put our user credentials in. Here we can see all our projects on our mobile device. Now I recommend keeping this clear and empty as possible. Too many projects on this are going to make connection to register 360 and the download of your projects slower than you'd want. Now your BLK360 connects to your mobile device via Wi-Fi. So we go to our settings and Wi-Fi and connect to the BLK360 Wi-Fi network. Now if this is the first time connecting your BLK360 to your mobile device, you're going to need to input the Wi-Fi password, which can be found under the battery cover. Once we're connected, we can go back to our Field360 app and see some basic device information. Now we're all ready to start scanning.